excited, Jennifer. So very excited. Hear ye, hear ye. It's time for the naming of the baby of Bree. We are going to call him Applebee's, and he will give riblets to people <laughs> all across the nation. There it is. The KSDK, the KSDK Channel 5 Royal Baby has officially been known. All hail Applebee's and his sister over here, Fazoli's and IHOP. The Royal Babies. Let me, Pat, let me give you a little history lesson. Uh, back uh, some hundreds of years ago, we threw a bunch of Starbucks in a Boston Harbor to get rid of the British people so we could do our own thing. Do you remember that? And we won a war, and then we went on. We don't wear these anymore because we uh, made that stuff. What's that bald stuff called, Mac? Aye. Uh, yeah. The stuff that cures baldness. We did that. And while Rogaine. Uh, Rogaine. And while they're there wearing powdered wigs and having bad teeth, we created or orthodontics and iPhones. We've moved on to become the most powerful nation. So why do we care about that anymore? That's what I ask you. They do have good morning manners, unlike us, but they got big ears like satellite dishes. And our leaders, oh, wait a minute, our leader does too, got big ears like satellite dishes. <laughs> what I'm basically saying, though, is we have moved on. Now, ladies, I understand about the wedding thing, because from babies, Disney tells you, you're a princess. You're, we used to have Cinderella and, and Snow White, but now I got a five-year-old. There's like 11 princesses, one's from Louisiana, one's got a fishtail. So I understand that you want to have that kind of wedding. And to be honest with you, I like it because this really does give us a distraction from all the scandals that we have from the Zimmerman cases. It makes us, but I hate that Matt Lauer is the one that's telling me I have to love this. It's all about Matt Lauer and his people going down there eating crumpets. But I do, I enjoy it. And I do, I think, I think this is going to make a comeback. Now, I know Sarah Daly is kind of your fashionista there. Ask her if she'd ever go for a guy in a powdered wig because I'm, I'm going to try to make this happen. See you guys, hear ye! I am the town crier! The year is 1562!